Hey everyone, thank you all so much for the support and comments in my last upload. If you missed it, I spoke about what I was enjoying in Dark Tide as of late. And what I'd like to talk about today is something that I feel like isn't common knowledge amongst the average player base. Before the launch for Dark Tide, Fat Shark mentioned how they'd be allowing the use of mods going further into the game's development. So I went looking for any decent modifications to Dark Tide that could change how I perform or just make my life a little bit easier when I chose to play. So it's no surprise that Dark Tide has so many mods worth talking about from accessibility, quality of life changes, and vast improvements to the gameplay and its mechanics. So once again, I would like to spread some awareness towards a mod pack that literally has some essential mods to make your Dark Tide experience a better one. Now as I mentioned before, it's been about 6 months since the release of Dark Tide, and towards the beginning, mods weren't really all that helpful. There wasn't anything really game changing in any way. But now we have so many mods that honestly I didn't even think I needed until I tried them out myself. And thankfully, I didn't have to look too hard. Among the community hub for Darktide, within the guides tab, I found an amazing mod pack creator who goes by the name of Mesmorki. And for anyone looking, I will include the link to the guide in my description below. I'd like to highlight some of the mods that are featured in the mod pack itself. Just know that the mod pack as a whole is incredibly crafted, highly customizable, and extremely easy to install. Anyways, let's talk about one of the mods that I loved. One of them is called Numeric UI. With this mod, you can see the entire team's ammo count, timers for your operative's ultimate ability, as well as track your dodge counters. For me, this is a huge improvement for anyone that wants to make the most out of their team composition. It helped me look out for my teammates and manage who needs what most. Another mod I really like is called Health Bars. It's a highly customizable quality of life change that shows you the health of any specific enemy you want to track. This is again extremely useful for anyone wanting to track your own damage output with each weapon on a set difficulty. This alone has helped me with my build management, but mostly how I view specific blessings and perks now. Maybe you wish you could see how well you did after a match amongst your team. Well, there's a scoreboard mod too. Now you can configure what exactly you'd like to track and see it at the end of the match. And you can even view it after the match when you reach the hub. Now you can see who helped get materials, who outputted more damage, and best of all, bragging rights when it comes to who killed the most specials. For complete transparency though, this was helpful to see how I was doing, just like health bars. It made me consistent in how I play, and seeing my progression stay in a balance was really nice to see. Fat Shark, I hope you're listening. There are even crafting mods. Reroll until rarity is a must-have mod for anyone looking to spend seconds with Hadron. Rolling your weapons or curios with the rarity of your choice has never been easier. What if you weren't sure about the blessings you've collected? Well, the mod called Reveal Blessings does just that. It shows you all of the blessings you've collected, as well as the ones you have left to earn. There's even an icon that will appear underneath your item signifying whether you have earned that blessing or not. Some of the best quality of life mods are also within this mod pack. One of which I love is called the Contracts Overlay Mod. With this mod, I can see my progress for how my weeklies are going as well as having it track while in mission. This mitigates having to go to Melk to see my progression every time I came back to the Morningstar. I love playing my Psyker more than any other class in the game. So for those who struggle with quelling your peril, True Peril is a mod that shows you a more accurate representation of your peril meter. This alone will help you manage whether or not you can appropriately brain burst the next pox hound that hops on your teammate. Now if you're like me, and you like things less cluttered, Sorted Mission Grid does exactly what it sounds like. No more looking all over the screen for the mission or difficulty that you want. Everything is neatly organized in level order now, making it easily readable the second you start looking for what you want to run next. All these mods are within this mod pack, and Mesmorki deserves a lot of praise for putting together a nice guide going over what each mod does and how to install everything. The instructions in the guide are straightforward and I was able to get everything set up in less than 2 minutes and get right back into the action. For anyone wanting a little bit more out of Darktide, I recommend this mod pack. And remember that mod support will only get better with time. I have a lot of faith in this community as a lot of you have already had a ton of constructive criticism in my last video. I like to use this platform and my channel to spread a little awareness to those who didn't already know about these mods. I try my best to highlight things that I feel like are worth mentioning to those who want the most out of the games that they own. And luckily, we don't have to look too far. So enjoy, and good luck. Hope you have a wonderful day. My name is Zen, and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Take it easy.